Well, hello viewers. Well, I've got a case and the cat loves it. But anyway, this video is about setting up the failsafe on the Ready to Fly model. I think a few people maybe have issues with it, but... Right, first of all, when you turn on your controller, you've got to keep these two trims in as you turn it on at the same time. I've already done that. Press OK, get into the system. Menu, OK, down to RX setup, down to failsafe. Now each channel, you can move down one, two, three, go to one, press OK. And I've already got that on. You can turn that on and off by going up or down. But you want to turn all the channels on. And what I do then is on channel 3, which is the throttle. And you can see what I've done if I press OK. It's just up a little. I have it on 3%. Reason being, that'll give me a little bit of throttle as it loses contact with the uh, transmitter. It'll just come down to earth, or top of a tree, more likely, but gently. Uh, all your channels set are zero, five and six, are minus hundred. Uh, that's been, zero means centre stick, basically. Um, five and six at minus a hundred. <coughs> show you all the channels are on that's okay right really important press and hold cancel and that'll save the settings believe it or not and then just come out of that and uh, that is now set up fail safe is set up so if you lose contact with your e 250 it should come down to the earth gently. Oh, like I said, the top of the tree. But anyway, I'm happy. You've learned something new. I've got a new case. See you all later.